Hi everyone, my name is Danny Marty and I'm a 3D artist and a game developer. In this quick tutorial I want to show you just a quick way to create a material that is tree planner and you can use it to with any 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 object that doesn't have any UVs or doesn't have good UVs. I'm sharing this with you because this morning I was looking for tutorials to do it and I thought well I saw that most of them are like 10-15 minutes long when you can do that in probably less than one minute. So let's do it. So here I'm in Blender and I would just want to show you the model that I have, like it's this weird cube. So we can jump into the UV editing and you can see there is no UVs. And if we go to the information on the vertices or the geometry, uh, here you can see that there is no UV map. So here we are in Unreal, I just imported our model. I'm gonna jump to the content browser and create a new material. So we are gonna call it uh, Tree Planner. And then let's open the material. And here we only need a couple of things. First of all, uh, let's open, let's create a texture object and we can convert this in a parameter. So when we do material instances, we can just change the textures. Uh, we are gonna need one for the diffuse. We are gonna need another one for uh, our masks. And then we are gonna need another one for our um, normal. Here, let me change this one for default normal so once we have our uh, uh, images or textures here um, we are gonna need we can just type word align and then we are gonna need the one that it's called word align texture this one is gonna be uh, needed two times. And then we are gonna need another one that it's called word align uh, normal. So once we have this, we can plug our diffuse here. Then we want the X, Y, Z to the base color. For the masks, we are gonna do the same. The only difference here is because here we have different information stored in uh, different channels. We want to mask uh, the channel, so component mask. And in this case, we only need two because we don't have any information that we are going to use in the blue channel. So what you want to do is select your uh, mask and here we only want the red channel for the ambient occlusion. And then we want the green channel for the roughness. If it was a normal mask, you could have uh, metallic in the blue, so you would do the same and then plug it to the metallic. For the normal, we are gonna plug that here and then the X, Y, Z to uh, normal. The last thing we can add, it's another parameter and that can be called um, the texture size. And that's gonna go here on our texture size, texture size, and texture size. And if you are using mega scans, uh, we can put, for example, uh, 200 as a default, because that's the normal kind of size for uh, mega scans. So now that we have our uh, master material, we can, oops. We can go here, uh, content. I can create my um, material instance, material instance tree planner. And then here I downloaded a texture from Megascans. So we can just block. Let's activate these three. And then you can just plug that here the normal with the normal and the masks with the masks and that's it and then you could adjust the texture if you want but basically that's it we can now 
um, go to here and then apply the material instance. And you have your uh, tree planner material, very fast, very easy, and yeah, that's it.